Tonight, family, friends, and neighbors are praying for two young boys who police say were shot by their mother in Upper Makefield Township. They gathered for a vigil in Washington Crossing tonight. The brothers are on life support. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Roberts is live with how the community is remembering them tonight. Alicia? Jessica, good evening. This is the same church where the boy's mother was taken into police custody yesterday. And now one day later, friends of the elementary and middle school brothers came together to grieve. We really just felt like uh, after the initial shock that we wanted to create a space for our community. To... A community in mourning. Our hearts are broken. Our lives are shattered. Friends and classmates of 13 year old Jeffrey JT and 9 year old Nelson Tinney came together Tuesday night inside the Washington Crossing United Methodist Church to remember the brothers allegedly shot by their mother inside their Upper Makefield home early Monday morning. I think a lot of them are numb. They just, like, it's just unthinkable because this is a mom that they knew because they had spent a lot of time with Jeffrey and been at his house or, you know, been in the car with his mom, and it's just. You don't, this does not happen. 38 year old Trin Wen sits behind bars on attempted murder charges while her two young sons remain on life support, waiting to donate their organs through the gift of life. Bad situation she was dealing with, and I did, we all didn't know it was that bad. Mm -hmm. She was a kind person. According to court records, Wen was being evicted from the property she rented from her ex husband's sister and had reportedly attempted to shoot her ex husband's nephew. Now, as so many, so young, try to cope, they find strength in each other. The best thing we could do is just be there for them. 